got two thousand. George Lutrot, <laughs> counselor into brackets. Why are you laughing so hard? You know, Bella, Bella is shocked, right? <laughs> she's not like, hearing. No, you actually no, took two thousand eight hundred. But will you ever take uh, two thousand Ghana cities or more? Four thousand. Two thousand Ghana cities is not two thousand eight hundred dollars. No, but you, will you take that amount of money? It is not two thousand eight hundred. See, in America, two thousand. A dollar is six point three euros. No, no, you see. So two eight hundred no, so, times six point three. So unfortunately for you, when you are in America and you are very, very wise, what you don't do is that you don't do conversion. You be there and say don't do conversion. No, no, I mean me. You, I'll do it every day. Oh, Bella, don't do it. You get Why? sick. Don't don't do it. No, you have My to. My first time Bella, in America. Please. That's what I was doing. The shade is wearing seventeen thousand six hundred and four. And you are the one who must Ga pay eleven. Ghana then. cities. Government of Ghana. These no, are no, the people no, who no, have to pay No, no, no. But but when I bought it, I paid the taxes there. So if I'm wearing it here, they so, should pay so, taxes. So plus to me. tax was two eight or minus yes. tax. Plus tax came. Yeah, what to came out? Yes, and so you see, it's nothing. You Do you know why it's nothing? It's nothing because in the first place, when you're sitting here, you're 2,000 Ghana cities. All right? It's somebody's $2,000. It's because when I wear a conversion. They're a conversion. Wait. No. How much no. are glasses say? Uh -huh. Have you clean your hands? You, you, I have sanitized. I've sanitized. done everything. Just, hold it gently. Please. Where you're coming from, Corona is even worse. Hold it slowly. So it's called, have you seen some before? What brand is this? Because there's no uh, name uh, on uh, it. Uh, you see? A signature, but you see, at the end of the day, you okay, don't even know what I'm Cookie, which one is this? It can't be such a New York middle. But watch it well. No, watch it. You don't. Watch. You see, you've not seen some before. Okay, it, wait. It, Please. Can we do this? Very. He says it's Versace. Let Maybe I haven't seen it's, this. It's medicine. Um, <laughs> I haven't seen ah, this signage before. Hey. Please, is this the Versace signage or something like? Me na siko ya jeme. No, so unfortunately, you, you, don't, no, you don't know what you're holding. That's what I'm you're asking. You're opening it. Stop opening. It's <laughs> not legs. It's not legs. It's not legs. You know, your hands are shaking. Give me back my thing. You spoiled it to have 10 years. This is, are you sure you bought this for two years? In the Versace. No, you're you contaminating that thing. I will, I will Let them catch it up on my face. Come on. This is signature. It's Versace signature. Come on. Let me Google Versace signature. Because you don't What do you say, mom? 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 What do you say, I say, chop the money and when you die, your family will be to pay at your funeral grounds. Sorry? Disika Guho. Signature logo. Send a bit of a Now, who's going to get you? Gansler. <laughs> Uncle George, yeah, I don't tell you Uncle about. George, sorry, please sorry. be in line. But who brought this to us? You are out of line now. No, please. so who brought it? No, maybe so. Say, life now, what bono? And I will start to kick up, kick up. Me both go out, me busy and fo. Me be who are omo tuya. Omo no money asem. Bible say na prophet inu we na or the car. Omo no money asem. Me nyaya me ni bela di ayi no fanta ni mouth. Omo no money asem. You better be careful, mohoka. Ah, you want to me different for you. Your mom wanted hundred Ghana. I'm still investigating the sunglasses. Please, anyway. Unless I don't know anybody who knows and has seen the sunglasses, can that you please is, tell is, us if it see, is? Anytime you are working with people within class, I wore this thing to a uh, few days ago. Uh, Me, I don't know. I don't know. I had a party three days ago of a very prominent person. When I entered, the old man, the first thing he saw was this. Mm. So people, Uncle George. 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 Uncle TV3, dear my major share. Ma, ma zoom in on my arm robbers and be, be attacking me. Nanya wan abaka says 2000. You can't be, you can't see it. How the arm robbers have known if you had not mentioned their mouth? I'm going to wear a studio hat. Then I'm going to be here. You go ahead. Anyway, your fans are waiting for you to donate money to them. Can we please talk about life now? Can we move on and talk about life? Let me say a Merry Christmas to your CEO. I am a very sweet, sweet, sweet lady. I like her so much. Say a happy Merry Christmas to all of them. Well, we've mm. been doing well. I watch you every morning. Mm. I mean, it's at dawn, but I know it. Mm. 3 a.m., you know, mm. but it's good. Mm. Keep it up. Uh, work yourself out. You. Um, you didn't this, buy a gift. I only give people things they ask for. That's the thing. I, I don't buy things. Okay. Perfume, I don't know the one you You have not even felt a perfume on your body before. How perfume. do you feel perfume? I feel like I tried it. You, you don't feel okay, perfume. ladies. You smell it. Listen, ah, feeling Bella, it. And <laughs> Bella and Uncle George, I'm going to leave the show for you too. I'm going to leave the show for you. How these people, eh? <laughs> 
and and I, I was expecting this <laughs> between you and Bella. Anyway, so let's channel the energy to the letter that we are about to deal with this uh, morning. Yeah, yeah, Please maintain go. the same energy. Maintain I mean, the I have same, not lost energy Maintain before. the same energy for me. Anyway, so moving on to a letter that we received, and Bella and Uncle George are also going to help us this morning break it down but if you can please um splash the letter on screen for us this morning i'll take a read through it and it says please uh, it says dear cookie please i've been married for four years with two children <coughs> during the second pregnancy i had an argument with my husband because of his mistress and he sent me away after birth i have decided to make peace in my matrimonial home but the issue is i insulted my mother-in-law whilst I was sent away with a five months pregnancy. But this was because she supported her son and cared less about what I was going through. I said he hateful things to her because she did the same to me. It was not intentional at all. I was in pain by then and couldn't believe she could do what she did to me. I want peace. I want my family back. Please, how do I win back my mother-in-law? I have been apologizing to her for about a month a month now and i am still apologizing but i am not getting any positive feedback so that's the letter we are discussing this morning i'm sure many of you have your own experiences with in laws especially the women um from what i know um from the stories i've heard from married people it's only a handful of people who've been blessed enough to have very good in-laws and one person who would always praise her in-laws is chi chi Nyo -Nyo. yeah yeah, yeah. Nyo -Nyo. Nyo -Nyo. always and always praise her mother-in-law she's become like i'm not her missa anybody who praises the mother-in-law has a problem but go ahead must you always start on this tangent anybody who what Anybody who is nice with a mother-in-law has a problem in the future. You can never be a friend to your mother-in-law. It's Why wickedness and disrespect. But go ahead. You, you need peace home. And so no, your mother-in-law is not unpeaceful. You being nice with her brings war. How? Because you're not supposed to be. My wife and my mother can never be fine. For what reason? They can't be friends. You prefer they fight? Why can't they don't fight, but they can't be friends. Their respect must be there. Their respect no, no, no. is that what? she's an in-law and you respect her in that level. You don't have to be nice with your mother-in-law. Kosha, uh, you jebu jealous. Not there, but if you buy, uh, uh, you see them wearing the same dress together. No, not not. No, my but camp. it's Christmas. So, so you, you, are you trying to tell me that if it's Christmas and I pick up a phone and I say, "Oh, hi, mommy, Merry Christmas." It's not your mother. That word on my mother. What you do you mean? Call I shouldn't call. I shouldn't call you mother, my mother-in-law, mother mommy. She is your mother-in-law. Don't miss the word. So, but what should we call her? But mommy? she's my she's mother. But not your mother, and you can never be her daughter. Keep that in your head. So, what do I call her? Auntie she is, No, she's mother-in-law. If she to my father. And because, I mean, I'm getting worried. When your parents are married for too long, they frustrate you in marriage. So if she's still married, you still call her Mrs. Lutrot, uh, hmm. uh, my mother-in-law. It's nice. But never refer no, to her as mother. No, what do you mother. mean? So I should say, oh, hi, mom in law Good morning. How are it's, you? That is more respectful. Good morning. How are you? It's not your age. Why can't you ask a grown-up how are you? You see, you people... You are coming from America. No, Little no, children. I have been here. Uh-huh. And I've never changed. No, so what? Is it wrong for a Ghanaian child to say, It's oh, a hi, wrong mommy, thing for a human being who is younger to ask an older person, how are you? You don't respect. For where are you coming from? Blessings flow from the top to the down, not from the down to the up. So you, every time you meet a grown-up, the grown-up will ask you, how are you? Good morning, sir. Good morning. How are you? So, so hold I on. Let's always... say you call your, your mother-in-law, yes. your father-in-law. You say, oh, hello, sir. Good morning. That's Please, all. how are you doing? No, no, no. Hello. Good morning, father-in-law. Oh, good morning. Daddy, uh, you our mean. daughter in law, how are you doing? I am fine, sir. How is it? How we are doing good. Thank God. So, what Abena. you cannot inquire how he's doing and how his businesses and his family is also Who doing? Who are you? You don't what respect. Do you, no, what do you mean you don't respect? <laughs> no, you don't. Like you no, call, how like you call, no, ask him how like you have the opportunity to call His Excellency the President of the Republic of Ghana. They say, Good morning. Good morning. Hey, Nana one, how are you doing? How is everything? Is everything okay with you? Obumo. Is he on hospital bed? Hello, sir. No, please, how George. are you doing? I hope you are well. Yes. Uh, are you okay? Yes, we are very okay. okay. So I shouldn't ask, so he tells you me don't that have the I don't right. care that's about why, him. That's why we have too many shots. No, we are dying you, too what early. What do you mean by we don't have the right? I right say your very... right to demand how are you doing is depend. You know, it depicts and reduces your ability to grow. AJ, so your mother-in-law and communication, AJ, please, don't go there. On this note, we, hey. we are going to be opening the phone lines very soon. I also want to hear your perspective out there. What you think about what Councillor Lutrot is saying. I don't think it's disrespectful at all if i meet my mom or dad or even my in-law 
So I greet them good morning. Them good morning. I go ahead to ask them how they are doing. I do not think that it is disrespectful in any way. Our constitution doesn't state it anywhere. I've not heard any folklore anywhere that has said or any story from, from when we were kids, from Anansi Sem to whatever that has ever said that it is wrong for me to ask Openi how he's doing. What I know is you cannot insult an Openi, hello, hello, hold but Sem may be so Openi send a whole year. Hold on. I'm holding hold on. on. If you said Anansi Sem, uh -huh. there are more than 26 Anansi stories. That's that depicts the way you should relate to a grown-up when you meet them. But I want to bring your conversation to the topic from your last point, uh -huh. where you said, uh -huh. you're waiting for constitution for you to know how to respect the elderly. No, I'm not waiting We're for it. Not. I'm saying that the constitution doesn't even state it anywhere, that it is wrong. So I'm saying that say... each of the constitutional provisions that were made uh -huh. were made in, in line mm. with first the Bible. So you see the first page of our constitution says, mm and to the almighty God. God. Mm -hmm. So that's how it starts mm -hmm. now. When we come to respect, respect is not reciprocal, is one way. Mm -hmm. Number two, love is not reciprocal, is one way. One of the things we are trying to bring into the system is that we are equal. If you ask your mom and ask your mom, mom, how are you doing? It makes sense. If you call me this old man sitting now, you this my daughter. I greet you, young man, the driver. What I'm saying is that you this my daughter calls me your father and say, how are you? I'm okay. But your father-in-law, you call me and ask you, how are you doing? In what capacity are you requesting? Why are we projecting in law you at such a high level? Because, I mean, because you're in married laws, to their child. No, no, and where so you in are laws, automatically their child no, no, too. No, where, so no. if I can greet my mother <laughs> and say, how are you? Why? Why? Cookie. I'm Can't taking you as my, my father or my mother as well. Why can't I Bella, say the same to you? Stress. Can't now, trust. Let's are go you to the Ghana? story. So can't let's go. Are you in Ghana? Come again. At family sittings, or even this Christmas, that many in-laws will be coming together with their married children. Yehu Bella, because oh meba, oh what to say? Hello, hello. Hello, hello. That's what my father-in-law and my mother-in-law would me. ask when they see me this tell Christmas. Me, me, me. 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 Who want to say? But me, I mean to me, friend hey, of mine, many papa. Who want to say? Papa, I'm patching me. Who here? He ends there. Say, who want to be teacher? Ah, who want to be any of you? Who debut? Who want to answer? Ben, any? Masiba. They have to clarify mm -hmm. because he just uses it figuratively to greet you. Me see. The blessing flows from higher level to the down level. And we are going beyond because we don't understand the protocol. And let me narrow down to this in-law thing. She has a very brilliant thing. Why are we projecting in-laws? Who is an in-law? Mm -hmm. I marry Bella. Now you are my mother. Okay? For today, you are just a mother. This is my wife. So between me and Bella, you are my mother. This is Bella. Who is an in-law here? Bella, this is your mother-in-law. Mm -hmm. Cookie, between me and you, who is the law? The word is in-law, who is the law? So let me explain to you. Bella is my wife. Mm -hmm. You are my mother. I am your son. Mm -hmm. Through me, Bella has become your daughter-in-law. So who is the law? I am the law. Okay. Why are you the law? Because without me, Bella will There's never no come into connection. the family. I'm the conduit. Okay. So Bella has no rights on earth. To have any communication to you without the law. Ah. That is then why. Then why did you bring me to the family? Uh -huh, that is why I'm. That is why you are the most important thing to me. That I project you to them. But I'm also the most important thing to your parents. Especially no, if you're no, the only child. No, and even if I'm the no, 20th no, I'm child. Just, I'm just citing an example. Uh -huh. That you are. I'm also equally important. No, we're not saying I'm not important. I'm saying that so, your importance is, is projected by me. Your husband. So, I made so, you the law. The so same like on. your mother-in-law and my father-in-law too. So it means you cannot call my mother mommy. You cannot call my father daddy. No, they are my in-laws. But they automatically become your You stop using the friends. word. That is where the disrespect is. Because if this young girl we are talking about tells me that she is angry and she's in pain, that is why she was able to insult their mother-in-law if truly she has a projection that this woman looks like my mother. Has she ever insulted a mother before in her pain? Ah, but this is the hey. same mother-in-law who knew that my husband had a side chick, had a mistress. Hello. But Omuhuna, wait, 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 let me finish. <laughs> but Omuhu side chick now. Nah. Thank oh, you. Oh, our wife, our wife, exactly. how are you? Because we're addressing her, our Hello? wife, our Hold daughter. On. Hold on. And I'm who here? And I'm 
just hello take, a, take, take your time because side chicks are part of marriage oh my god here and they are the again. medium by which men grow longer here we go older, again older and they don't die prematurely because i'm always two, going to can have I finish? a problem hold on i'm can always going to have me, a problem with always you always let me finish and when i finish you can you, you hold on let me finish on TV when you let me finish because you are not coming i know i know more people are watching than you you are sitting here with me one day how do you know more because anytime you sit on tv people know bella has come me i just came <laughs> and I know everybody's watching. <laughs> now watch it. Hear, hear me, Cookie. I keep saying this thing, but you don't get it. I'm we, saying we don't that. Get it. So I'm saying that side chicks are part of the marriage structure. God blesses side chick. There's no curse God, on the side. God, who, hold, learn, hold on, my sister. As you learn from which page yeah, of the Bible? No. Page, but I won't ask you for the verse. Bible page, where they say Bible God says that. So the Bible says that. Mistresses. The, hold on. The Bible says that God brought a man on earth called David. Mm -hmm. And when David came, he was so blessed to the sin that God wanted him to build a church for him. Unfortunately, when he saw Uriah's wife bathing, the back He lasted after her. Oh, hold on. I'm preaching. I'm a man of God. He saw it and, you know, love after it and went for it. And he didn't use the right process to ask the girl to kill. God said, why did you do that? You could have asked me, I've given you. So you will not be able to build a temple. Then had a son called Solomon. So Solomon built a temple for God with how many wives and how many side chicks? When God is in your business, he blesses you with more women. Those of us who are married to only two wives, when God we are is suffering. In, when God is in your business, a man who marries you. more than one will never die premature death. Because all marriages, look, most widows you see in his town. His wives will seven, keep fighting and no, 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 will lead women to his love, no, now, women love, now, they don't fight. Uh -huh. Uncle George, yeah, how many but wives, stress Uncle from George, the, how many wives the, you the, have? The, the stress from two. the fight. You, yeah, you have two, two wives. wives. Ah, so you don't know who who is who the second who? one because we only know the first Mrs. Councillor Lutrud. Uh, no, there's now. no more Mrs. Mrs. Councillor Lutrud. No, there is there's councillor's wife. There's no Mrs. again. Huh? Huh? There's a councillor's. Okay, there's original so councillor's wife. Who is who the second who? one? How do you do second one? Why you are saying it on national television? You are teaching people to have two wives. Let let's know them. Sanya, where did you find the second wife? They are there. Everybody knows them. By custom or by law, where did you find your wedding band? Ah, but who says wedding band means that you are married? Ah. Okay, so let me continue my conversation. It you see, you're, you're, you're just you confusing all yourself. But let me learn, let me let's learn this thing. So Oi, I'm Oi, saying that Oi, an in-law. Can I finish? No, let me finish. No, 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 let me learn and finish this. Let me make his point. So when it comes to an in-law, the in-law is there because of the presence of the mind. How do you insult your in-law? Can you insult your mother? Then Cookie is telling me that because your mother-in-law knows that there's a side chick, they are praising a side chick. The first thing is that if there is a side chick mm -hmm. and the family have accepted the side chick in the first place, you ask yourself, what is the side chick doing for the family to accept side chick? Ask that question. That's one. Number two. If you say you are insulting because he, he's, he's condoning to the son, man dear, me, my mother. There's no way on earth that you report me to my mother that my mother will be on your side. Of course, that's not So true. why do you I take my mother know, as your mother? I say, oh, mom. No, but there are times when the in-laws in also, you know, side the wife or the husband, depending any on time, what, no, any time what I, their child is doing. Then it wrong. means that they want to use you against their child. Hold on with that. No, let's learn. Yeah, we'll learn. Hold on. Honestly. We'll have to take a break. So you uh, hold You are on. coming. Never be a friend to your mother-in-law. We are coming where? Hmm? We'll be Bella, back. Uh, when break. you hear we'll coming, you get confused. Bella, please take the break. We'll be in. back. And uh, well, Vic has sent, Vicky has sent a message. She actually agrees with Kelsey. I don't understand how. <laughs> but we'll be back to read some of these comments as well. If I get you correctly, once she made that mistake of insulting the mother-in-law, she shouldn't even make an attempt to go and apologize because so, it's... So, so this is the thing. If, if, my, if my wife offends my mom, the right person to make my, my mom understand what has happened is me. Okay. Mm. I am the law. That I agree. Okay. You are an in-law, so I'm the conduit. Okay. So I, I made a statement sometime, and somebody understand that, Cookie, if I, this is our wife, this is my wife, you're my mother-in-law, and we come to our family house. Right. My wife doesn't wake up early in the morning. Never. In our house, she won't. Mm. She's a visitor in the house. Okay. Mm. And my sisters will serve you. Oh, so you so don't you have, have to go out and go and sweep the compound. Who, where are you sweeping? That I agree. Because okay. in our family house, in my mother's house, there are things that you think you are sweeping, but it's a protection for the house. You go and sweep it. <laughs> <laughs> and so you okay. don't have to sweep. All when they are bent by. Okay, and so who so, don't see? No, so, but the same mothers-in-law will complain that no, your no, wife no. is No, no, no. They complain because your husband doesn't know the protocol. Mm. You see the dress you are wearing. Mm. Anytime you are going to a house, mm. you dress well. Mm. 
Make up. Mm. Then when you go, my mother is pounding fufu. You go and collect a person to pound. Who bond dog? Never. You, you wait for the fufu to eat in the sitting room. Hey. That, At least you pretend. Offer. That's oh, mommy, that, can I help? That is an insult. If you didn't come with the pound of fufu. Oh my God. How is this an insult? The, people don't love the way I treat my wife. But listen. You're dead. They are my wife. You see, they are the queen. If you come to my house, my mother comes to my house. She's treated like the best queen in the world. Mm -hmm. In my house, mm -hmm. my wife serves my mother like a maid servant. Mm -hmm. But anytime I carry her to a family house, mm -hmm. she relaxes. In has, the morning, her water is ready to go and bath. Nobody asks. Now you didn't sorry. Or sorry, I bear then. Then shut up. She's not going to cook for the family. For what? So the, the person who can cause the amendment is the son. Is the son. Is the son. And so in com marital conflict resolution, one of the things you should learn is that me, you are my mother. If I do anything against you, mm -hmm. don't go and tell my mother. Mm -hmm. Go and tell your mother. Okay. Then your mother and father will call my mother and father. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. Or see X Y Z. But then now can't see and oh oh. Or see your may your may or my worry and so or see me. No, he or see your may. So I'm talking about him. Me ma and he won't. Your child and my child. So it's no no. It's your child. No, no, so it's you your child. Tell me no listen. Your child. George. My child is beating oh, our child. You know mm -hmm. that story. No. <laughs> <laughs> My child, your, your child is beating our child. Okay. If you when I married, I brought two. You brought two, and then you came to fire one inside the way. Okay. So they are beating the one uh, we brought to the marriage. Okay. So what I'm saying is that mm. this solution will only come mm. from the sun. Charlie, but but, son, no, no, yeah, son, so what exactly. Side yeah, no, no, I I I as any woman who is interested in your side chick is a witch and wants you to die Counselor, to become a widow. Hold on. Can I explain that thing well mm. for you? Cookie, hold on. Cookie. Before, before you even you move on, what I want to ask is that Instead of speaking to you, my husband, to go and beg your mother for me, can I not go to my parents and tell them that I've disrespected my mother-in-law? So, so please go and speak no, to them. No, in the first place, because you left the house and you have gone away. No, they sent me away. No, because... What they, they sent me away. Whatever they sent you, because you left the house, your marital home, you get to your mother's place. You've announced the reason why you are there. Mm -hmm. Okay. So your mother will say, what's it then? Oh yeah, what's it bar? Hey, have you watched a video circulating where the lady slapped the man and the host was watching? Immediately, your mother will say no. Even your pregnancy five months. What's the way you're doing? Mm -hmm. You insulted your mother-in-law. Hey, Adwa! No, but they should rather call your mother-in-law and ask her no. why. No, your, your husband let ask you to leave mm. and you went to your family. And mm. your in-laws also supported him in pushing you forget, out of your no, mind. Forget about their support. The first thing is that you are now confessing to us that what you did was wrong. So the adults should rather meet and discuss it. No, why the should adult your husband meet, be the no, one? The adults are meeting because, watch it here, you... You told your mother why you left your husband's house. Uh -huh. your, why I was kicked out. No, no, you told your mother why you left your husband's house. I was kicked out. Munja is a kick out. Ah, no, but you kicked me out. No, they didn't kick you out. Your, your, your attitude deserved you to be out of the house. What if I so did anything kicked, wrong? Then that is where you are kicked out. But this one, you did. there was an event that registered your absence from the house. Okay. So I'm saying that your mother who you came to meet in the house, I do have a few. Mira. I just say, or did not say, by any antoqua, why ye and the Sam as you see, and you couldn't see Umbra Metana Hambew. Mira, ye and Yanni, then, oh, then a buyer draw. So your father and mother will interrogate you, then they will now find a way not to meet your husband. But they will go and meet the in laws. And it's likely when they go, they don't give him face even to talk. But that is how the solution is. Okay. Stop saying I'm apologizing. You have no right to call my mother and say, Mom, but your Bella Ni, Bella Bang, and Quacu, Quacu Yere. Now Bella Bang, you know him. It, it, that's that's a sarcasm or or on on um, pimple um, so that this is our friend no. What I say this statement it tells so it's not ready to be hear you. Bella Ben, eh eh, kwe kwe yere. Me nyau dembio. Nasa o me number dada. O me number dada. We're changing the phone. That why you go? We're changing the phone. That why you go? So the only way this lady can survive in the first place is that he should let the fam family begin to negotiate on her behalf. Number two, the husband should understand that what the wife did was wrong, and she must also know what she did was wrong and find a means. But the way to a wife is now. The rest of okay. you who are insulting your well, in-laws in the guys, take this number and call me so that we can settle the issue before you insult them. Call Shayo Jabo Kajaleko 0277 609 
44. It is the Orgasm Conference. 0277, 26 December, 609. See, so for be careful to give full respect to your mother-in-law. Don't insult them when they insult you. When they insult you, become a cartoon and be quiet. Oh, Don't be done. smart. Oh, you are done. Because Thank you so where, much. Where, it's not oh, easy to have a Vicky, Vicky, Thank good you. morning to you. Thank and Vicky, you. interestingly, Vicky agrees with you all through. Why are you worrying? Oh, no. I mean, she's also older, so she's saying that so you for see those of you who way. appreciate tradition mm -hmm. and customs, you would understand what Kansa is saying. But quick one, before we wrap up, I'd like to say a big thank you to Sheila Bonsu uh, for styling me every Friday on the show. Find on social media, <laughs> Sheila Bonsu underscore RTW. And this Christmas, she's making some of the most lovely dresses like what I'm wearing, uh, fusion of prints and other fabrics. So get in touch with her, Sheila Bonsu underscore RTW. Cookie. Uncle George, we thank you so much for joining us this morning. God bless you. We'll have you again. A lot more. A lot more. And you I have the orgasm conference coming on soon. 26 December. This year we are treating managing chamber conflict. Managing chamber, chamber conflict. A woman who sleeps with her abrasia is, is trying to give the husband mouth Ah, without a bra? Yes. So you should sleep with a bra on? Yes. What's for? Ah, look at Cookie with her bra. That's breast will ah. be on the tummy. <laughs> when you come home and your wife's breast is on the tummy. Ah. Nah, for four. <laughs> Whoa, for four, no. Well done, well done. Whoa, for four, no. Well done, thank you so much, Kansa. We'll see you on Monday. I can't do this anymore. <laughs>